Okay, for this next view of the skull, we're going to be doing the AP Towns. Uh, this one, we're going to turn the patient around so they're facing the x-ray tube. The goal is to get the OML perpendicular to the image receptor. And we're also going to throw a 30-degree caudal angle on the tube. So I'm going to do that now. And it's going to need to go a little bit higher. Central ray should be two and a half inches above the glabella. So what I'm looking for here is tilt and rotation. I got a little bit of tilt to the right. So I'm just going to tilt your head a little bit to the left. And now I'm going to center my tube. I think I'm collimated too tightly from that last view. Okay. And what I'm going to do is lower this just a little bit now so that when I do my fine-tune adjustments, it won't be such a, a huge deal. Let's just open that wide. Okay, so let me have you kind of scoot back as far as you can. So it helps for the patients to uh, flex the neck if their hips are a little further back towards the image receptor. Let me have you drop your chin down towards your chest. A little more right there. That looks really great for the OML. I'm going to recenter you a little bit to the left, right there. And I'm going to recenter my Bucky. For someone who may have difficulty holding this position, you can always use a wedge sponge and place it behind their head. Now you can rest your head back on that. And we're going to do a final check. I look good left to right. I was lined up with my Bucky. I'm going to put a right marker down here, and then take on suspended respiration.